all day long. And we are. The thing is, we are. And it's gonna come to fruition. This is why we it's we, gonna we come. Divided. We, we don't want to come together with y'all. Right. What has happened when we and came together? Why. When did this Martin Luther King why. say he led us into a burning building when he let us down or would you crack us, man? We'll learn how to turn from the ways that we in. Somebody give me the book of Genesis, chapter 1 and verse 29, too. Acts 17. Gone. It's the book of Acts, chapter 17 and verse number 30. In the times of this ignorance, God winked at, uh -huh. but now commanded all men everywhere to repent. To do what? To, to repent. repent. Let the brother answer. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. So, did you hear that? Yeah, yeah. So he said he commanded all men everywhere to repent. Repentance is turning from your ways and not doing them things anymore. Right, right. Because if you just say, Lord, forgive me, I'm sorry, I went off, and you turn around and you do the same thing, you, do every day. you, didn't, and you didn't repent. Every day. Right. A pedophile can quote unquote repent every day. Is he going to get saved because he asked the Lord, I'm sorry, and I'm going to do the same thing tomorrow? That's all. Sorry, but I can't let that little booty alone. Okay. That's, that's crazy. Right, that's crazy. Hey, 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 right? But but look, brother, this is more important because this is what's gonna get you saved. Wherever wherever you gotta go is not important. Right. And the, the, the house of the Lord is important. That's right. Right. Hey, because like the brother said earlier, where two or three are gathered together, there I am in the midst. That's right. right. That's Matthew 18 and 20. So hey, the Lord is in the midst of us right now. Yes, sir. So y'all. Brother, turn the phone on D&D. Don't look at it no more, brother. <laughs> right? Bring this up. It's the book of Acts chapter 3 and verse 19. Like, I, I Repent ye therefore and be converted. Do what? Repent ye therefore and be converted, uh -huh. that your sins may be blotted out, when the times of refreshing shall come from the presence of the Lord. So, hey, when you repent, you, you get converted. Give me Romans chapter 12 and verse 2. Right? When you repent... Your mind gets converted. Now we gotta, you gotta learn what it means to, to convert your mind, right? Let me get that. Yeah, Romans 12 2. Give us two more, two more. We're gonna get you two more. We're gonna get you this and one commandment. Genesis 129. This is the book of Romans, chapter 12 and verse 2. Yeah. And be not conformed to this world, uh -huh. but be ye transformed Do by that. the be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. By the renewing of your mind. Don't be conformed to this world, because this world would like to tell you the, the stuff that's that that's Bad is good and good is bad. Like brother, what you just put down. That's killing you. And the Lord say that's bad. Right? Give me that in the book of Genesis 129. It's it's you know it's pork in there, brother. It's pork in there. It's killing you. Why do you think you got a cough? And cigarettes building up tar in your lungs. You get to run. You get to moving slower. Yeah, and you get the what, what they say. Uh, uh, yeah, and you uh, uh, get that hole in your throat. You get to talking with the box. Exactly. So, so brother, you knowing that? Why you keep putting the gun to your head and pulling the trigger? You playing Russian roulette. If the bullet ain't came out yet, you got two shots left, brother. It's like a drug, man. It's like a drug. You're addicted to it. Give me a uh, wisdom of Solomon 16 and 12. Wisdom of Solomon 16 and 12. Hey, come on, give me one more. This the book. Of, I gotta give you two. This the book of like Genesis. This the book of Genesis, chapter one and verse number 29. And God said, Behold, I have given you every herb bearing seed, uh -huh. which is upon the face of the earth. Uh -huh. It's like of all the earth, and every tree, and the which is the fruit of a tree yielding seed. Uh -huh. To you it shall be for meat. It shall be for what? For meat. Please spell it. M e a t. So it should be for meat. So everything that we get, all the herbs and everything, is for meat. It's not meant to smoke. It's meant to eat. So you smoking these things and, and, and inhaling them, right, and putting toxins in your body, and you killing yourself, right? right. Give me that wisdom of Solomon. Right. That, that, now, now, now we're going to show you what heals you. We're going to show you what gets you out of that stress that you got going on, right? It's the book of Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 16 and verse 12. It For it was neither herb nor mollifying plaster uh -huh. that restored, restored them to health. Uh -huh. 
But thy word. But what? But thy word. But what? But thy word. This restores you to health, brother. It's not the things that you lean unto in your time of need. Hey, when you when you're in a time of need, you lean unto the Lord, right? You don't lean unto these worldly things that quote unquote get the edge off, right? Because that's Satan. Satan rubbing your back, telling you to hit the cigarette, caressing on you, man. You don't want no grown man caressing on you, man, right? Because Satan, Satan is doing abominable things when you put that cigarette in you, man. So, brother, do you love do you love the Lord? Yeah. For the Lord, would you give up smoking? Because the Lord hates that. The Lord did not command us to smoke cigarettes, brother. It's a work in the progress. You know, I've been smoking over 30 something years. How long, how, how long was you smoking for, brother? 20. 20? I'm over 30 years. So, brother, stop. Yeah. It's not impossible. Yeah, it, but it, no, it's, 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 it's a pro, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a work in progress. Yeah, you gotta take steps. Yeah. What are you doing to stop it? You can, I stopped you can, it one day. Stay, like, you can just say like, uh, it, I'm, I'm gonna be done today. I no, quit cold turkey. I did. He, 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 I quit cold turkey. I quit cigarettes, black, and sand weed, same day. Yup. Hey, cause hey, give me that uh, uh Philippians man, four and thirteen. Hold on, hold on, brother. Man, we, man. We, 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 look, cause brother, it's important though, brother. They not gonna leave you if they love you. They not gonna leave you, brother. It's the book of Philippians, chapter four and verse number thirteen. I can do all things through Christ. You can do what? I can do all things through Christ. You can do what? I can do all things through Christ, which strengthening me. Hey, you can do all things through Christ. Brother, they did it. The Lord put the spirit on them to throw those things down, right. cast them into the to the pits of the earth, right. and never do them again. Now right. they abhor those things. Now they hate them. Right. Brothers hate the smell of a cigarette. Brothers right. hate the smell of weed. Right. Brothers hate the smell of a black. Right. You can too, brother. Because you can do it through our Lord and Savior, man. Yes, you just gotta have faith. Hey, brother. Start, start taking those steps, brother. Hey, what, what's your, what's your... Give us, you got a flyer. You got a flyer. Yeah, 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 Look, yeah, we got, we got all our social media, our YouTube on there. You can scan the QR code yeah. on the back right there and take you to our YouTube. We are, we out here every Saturday, brother. We'll be out here tomorrow. And, and, and if it be, and, if the Lord permitted, you know, and it's a little warmer, come back out here. We gonna be out here when it's raining, shining, sweet snow, brother. We gonna be out here. Okay, What's your name, King? I'm All right, I'm Zakar. Lord willing, we see you, brother. Be safe. All right. Hey, hey I'll praise to the most high, man. Hey, Lord willing, you know that seed was planted, right? But Esau can't get away. I ain't gonna lie. That damn devil, Harry Potter. Harry Potter, Harry man. Potter, man. Hey. <laughs> All over the place. All over the place, man. Give me Isaiah chapter 34 and verse 4. Give me Ezekiel chapter 25 and verse uh, 14, man. The book of Isaiah. To the 34 and verse number four and all the hosts of heaven uh -huh. shall be dissolved uh -huh. and the heavens shall be rolled together as a scroll uh -huh. and all their hosts shall fall down and all the hosts are going to fall down that's all the people that's sitting up on high in this kingdom man right. and we know who that is it's esau right and and chiefly the other nations in their respective kingdoms man they all sitting on high in their land uh 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 Chung Lee, man, sitting on high over there, man. They doing what they want to do over there, man. And they come over here and they oppress us. They sitting on high, right? right? The, the damn stinky Ishmaelites, man. Hey, hey uh, hack the hacked brother account, man. Yeah, hack the brother account. That's hey, crazy. hey, stinky Ishmaelites, man. Quote unquote wild man. Quote unquote. I ain't seen nothing. He, uh, the, the Ishmaelites over here must be scared. I ain't seen no wild Ishmaelite over here. Hey, we got all these big buildings. They they, don't they look tempting? Yeah, this is they Americanized. <laughs> don't these buildings look tempting? I know if I, hey, if I was an Israelite, not known for that. I'm full, full yeah. force into there. I'm, I'm hey. kai diving into there. Like you said, hey, wouldn't be, you know what I'm saying? Wouldn't be me. Well, hey, couldn't be me. Couldn't be me. I'm just, hey, me personally? Me personally. <laughs> That's just me though. You know, they, they, actually is doing something. They destroying our women, selling them weave and eyelashes. And they're gonna skimpy clothes at the damn beauty supply store. Yeah, but but at the end of the day, they, they ain't cowards, man. Yeah, they they cowards. down cowards, man. Hey, the, the Lord took that spirit of a wild man from them. They, 
got, got, got over there getting obliterated. Yeah. Kids, <laughs> kids over there, one arm is. Hey, they get they get mangled over there. They're starving to death. Starving to death. Hey, they, they down there. They turn into the uh for ten cents a day. <laughs> you can feed an Ishmaelite. And that's what they turn it into, man. You got the fly of the eye. Yeah. <laughs> and they, hey, they get desolate over there. The Lord is bringing them low, like you brought Can uh, Canaan low, man. Right. The land of Ham, he brought all them low. Hey, and the Lord is bringing them low right with him. Hey, Esau's next. Hey, hey, Ammon, right? And all the Japhetics over there, uh, 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 the Samoans. Hey, y'all next too, man. Right? You got something? Yeah, I was going to bring out uh, how, you know what I'm saying, the other nations, they just love America, man. All right. Remember, right. it's out of Revelation chapter 18 and verse number 9. Uh -huh. And the kings of the earth who have committed fornication and live deliciously. And what? And live, live deliciously. deliciously. Hey, they lick they, they lick they chops when they come over here, man. Yeah. They love this place. They forget about it. They forget about their land. Uh, 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 um, I uh, mean, highways uh, to St. Louis? The, um, who's them, um, they rabs, man. Yeah. When they come over, they women start putting on pants, uncovering their head. I went to school with one. They always wore dresses and they always wore the head wraps, right? I think they might've wore pants. I, back in the world, man, I went to like a few years ago. I was at uh, <laughs> Wheelhouse, Wheelhouse or Patios See that? over down there, right? And she come up like, oh, I know you. I'm looking like I ain't recognized because she had the damn hand wrap on. She's like, don't tell my sister. Woo, woo, woo. Hey, I heard freaking off in Babylon, yeah. man. You love this place. It yeah. enticed you. See you that? got drawn in, right? And if you got yeah. ears to hear, son went yeah. down in that hijab, he came off. Yeah, man. What's that? What's that one yeah. woman from Palestine? Uh, Mia Khalifa out here being a poor. Oh, yeah. oh, that's madness, man. Oh. Hey, that, that, <laughs> they were burned. They're stoner, man. They put acid on her. Face. Yeah, <laughs> put her on. They, 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 they crucify her, man. Yeah. Keep going on that. That's like that's how you know they got Americanized because they don't move in that same spirit in their homeland. That's why they leave her. Right. They had a whole other spirit. Because you know, know they. Hey, I, I seen a video where one of them was talking to me and looked at her she said and yeah. the, the reporter trying to talk to her she like mm -hmm. step back and then a man came up and started talking and they know better yeah. and they put hands and feet on women over there they put their whole that's what the quran tell you to do the quran tell you hey you can you can slap her up man like i seen the damn video it was some uh ishmaelite women i think they committed you know saying adultery or whatever they threw acid on their face See that? So they kind of jammed up now. Ain't no yeah. bag on you. Nah, yeah. nah. Put the ass on Case you blind. Yeah, your face, dog, face, face all just all jammed up. Yeah, it's 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 mangled, man. Another one. They say the people out there, uh, out there, the, the Ishmaelites, what they do in the, uh, according to Sharia law, they put your body in a hole to where your hole to where your just only your head showing. Stone. They take a stone by the hand, like it's about the big as your hand, and hit you in the head with it. Yeah, they put that, they put that white cloth over yeah. your head. Y'all know where it's coming from. And it just you just see blood get the form uh, forming out there. The water. Uh, keep bringing it up. It says, I'm gonna read it from the top. Revelation 18 and verse 9. And the kings of the earth who have committed fornication and to live deliciously with her shall be well hurt and lament for her uh -huh. when they shall see the smoke of her burning. Hey, they gonna, they gonna be sad when they see this place burning. Yeah. Oh, I'm not America, not not home of the free, land of the brave, right? Standing afar off for the fear of her, uh, for like for her torment, torment, saying, at last, at last, that great city Babylon, that mighty city, uh -huh. for in one hour is thy judgment come. And what? In, in one, one hour, hour is, is thy judgment, judgment come. come. That's what we telling our people. Hey, one hour, man. You got one hour to get right, man. This place is coming to an end, man. They see the clock. That's a lot of you. That's why they hate it. One hour, I mean, them nukes can really Today. destroy this place in an hour. Today. Those Two nukes. seconds. Ten nukes. It's Come on, just, people, 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 people got, hey, they got to learn how we talk, man. And hey, if you got ears to hear, man, it's not literally, yeah. it, it, it could be more than an hour, yeah. right? The Lord will speed these things up and slow them down as he pleases, <laughs> man. Right? Go back to that Isaiah, though. I mean, uh, yeah, go back to Isaiah and Ezekiel. The book of Isaiah chapter 34 and verse 4. Okay. And all the hosts of heaven shall be dissolved, uh -huh. and the heavens shall be rolled together as a scroll, and all their hosts shall fall down as the leaf falleth off from the vine. I can just see the, the leaf withering to the ground, man, swaying, getting tossed to and fro. Keep going. It says, and as a falling fig from the fig tree, 
For my sword shall be paved in heaven. For my what? For my sword shall be paved in heaven. Now the Lord is coming with cotton candy and hugs, but I don't think you're reading that right. Read it again. It said, for my sword shall be bathed in heaven. So what happened to that tap dancing ass uh, uh, coon? Who, 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 yeah, Christian. The Christian coon. The, the, the black. Boot licking ass Christian coon. Coon Christian. Coon Christian, man. That's what they is, man. East, they they boo kissing Esau. It's backwards, man. Keep going. He wouldn't do it. He did. <laughs> it says, "For my sword shall be bathed in heaven. Uh -huh. Behold, it shall come down upon Idumia. It shall what? It shall, it shall come, come down, down, upon down upon Idumia. It shall what? It shall come down, down upon Idumia. Hey, and destroy him. It's gonna come right over his head. Pook. Pook. Read that one more time. And it shall come down upon." I do me a. What's it gonna happen to these people? It shall come, come down, down upon I do me a, uh -huh. and upon the people of my curse uh -huh. to judgment. To judgment, man. Hey, that sword is gonna come down from heck. Hey, man, come on now. Come on now. All right. It's gonna be a lot of blood in that day, man. It's gonna be a lot of murder going on. All right. Right? It said, a slain of the Lord shall be many. All hey, brothers, right. sister, y'all got two minutes for the words of the Lord? Y'all got two minutes for us? Two minutes, brother. Two minutes, family. Figure why he could be foul, King. Come on, come on. I'm just, I'm enjoying my cousin's birthday tonight. I'm sorry. Two, two, two minutes, two minutes. Y'all love God? You I, love God, sister? I can learn something on the birthday. Well, yeah, let, let's learn two things. Can I give y'all two, two precepts? Just two. Hey, just be tonight. Just two. Just tonight. I swear. Just two, brother. Hey, give me Jeremiah chapter uh, 10 and verse 1. Might be your last birthday, brother. It, it might be your last night, brother. So don't you want to hear? Don't you want to try to get saved, brother? Don't you want to try to endure it to the end, Jeremiah 10 and 1? Uh, this is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 10. Slot here. In verse number 1, and it reads, Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Uh -huh. Thus saith the Lord, Learn not the way of the heathen. Do what? Learn, Learn not, not the way of the heathen. Do what? Learn, Learn not the way of the heathen. Uh -huh. And true, so like it. And be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. Hey, but the thing is, they choosing a the way after the heathen, man. Hey, what, well, what, what, can you give me that in the book of uh, Maccabees, man? Give me that in the book of Second Maccabees, chapter six, right? That's what they did, man. These heathens celebrated their birthday, right. right? And if we wouldn't bow down to it, we got a knee put on our neck, man. Hey, and our people willingly do the things of the heathen. Oh. It's utter madness, man. Straight madness. Hey, brother and sister, y'all got two minutes? Y'all got two minutes? Y'all believe in the Bible? Y'all believe in God? You believe in everybody? You believe in pedophiles? Y'all, okay, it ain't everybody then. Come talk, brother. Uh, uh, sh it, hey, 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 Esau is a pedophile. The white man's a pedophile. It's right. a lot of them, right? Hey, brother don't want to deal with their own people, man. They, they, oh, they, they some of the biggest coons. Uh, Edom might have come deal with us before they will, man. Right. That's utter madness. You can bring on uh, Second Maccabees, chapter 6. Well, 6 and uh, uh, 8, uh, uh, 7. The book of Second Maccabees, chapter 6 and verse 7. And in the day of the king's birth every month, they were brought by bitter constraint to eat of the sacrifices. And when the feast of Bac Bacchus was kept, the Jews were compelled to go in possession of Bacchus carrying ivy. Moreover, there went out a decree to the neighbor cities of the heathen by the suggestion of Ptolemy against the Jews that they should observe the same fashions and be partakers of their sacrifices. And do what? And be, be partakers, partakers of, of their, their sacrifices. sacrifices. Hey, they, they forced our people to be partakers of their sacrifices, man. Right. The birthdays, right? All these wicked pagan holidays that they had, that's why our people just bend a knee to them so willingly. It's utter madness, man. Our people bend a knee willingly to these wicked holidays because hey, of Stockholm Syndrome, right? Hey, the PTSD that was passed down. I was just reading the Willie Lynch letter, man. When they when they read, uh, uh, say how, how to break uh, uh, a slave, man. You break them like a horse. You don't get the old one, you get the young, right? You break the mother, right? You learn how to break her keep her in submission, you beat the older son or the father, you kill him, and she'll teach her young ones how to be subservient on up, right? And teach the women, you know, to uh, uh, be stronger and the men to be more effeminate. And that's why the roles flip 
because that's how they that's how they word and they like to say hey that that letter isn't true it's word for word bar for bar how it plays out esau is a damn demon man he likes to sit up here and lie and make these things up bring that out to isaiah mr book it's the book of Ezekiel chapter 25, verse 14. I will lay my vengeance upon Edom. What the Lord say? And I will lay my vengeance upon Edom uh -huh. by the hand of my people Israel. By what? By, by the, the hand, hand of my, my people, people Israel. Israel. You hear that? Did you hear that? You want to hear it one more time? No, I'm good though. Yeah, the Lord say he's going to lay his vengeance upon you by us. So one day, know that. One, one day, know that. It's going to be an ass whooping coming. One day, know that. It's going to be an ass whooping coming to you. Read. You know what I'm saying? I didn't do nothing. Give me Galatians 6 and 7. You didn't do anything? Give me uh, uh, Isaiah chapter 14, verse 21. Which nationality? Which nationality? Which nationality? Which nationality? Mine? Yeah. I'm a mixed breed. What's your father? My father's mixed as well. What's your father's father? Who knows? Hey, Esau, want to speak with that fourth tongue? We know what you are. Vagabond. Bring that out. You can preach shit all day long. Hey, we but are. The thing is, we are. And it's going to come to fruition. This is why we it's gonna come. Being divided. We, we don't want to come together with y'all. Right. What has happened when we came hey, together? Right. When did this Martin Luther right. King say he led us into a burning building when he led us down or would you crack us, man? Right. Right? Hey, we should have kept the, the Malcolm X's. We should have came and kept blowing y'all damn heads off. We need the we need the Black Panther Party back. Hey, to patrol our cities, because we don't need you, man. You the damn devil that the Bible speaks of. Right. Hey, yes, you are. You are. You have, you're wicked from the womb. Your forefathers are wicked from the womb. You need to get put to death. What you Hey, are you sorry? For what? For, my, for, for, for what your forefathers did to us. Because we pissed up here. We angry. We're angry for all this that happened. We get, we get people that say they sorry all the time for that. People say they're sorry all the time for that. I hate what happened. So, so how, how do you show you're sorry? How? How? I defend my kids every fucking Your kids? Yes. How do you show you're sorry for what your fourth time did? Oh, you know the fuck! I gotta show you what the fuck I'm sorry for. How? If I feel how? Sorry, and that's lip service. Because this that's right lip here, service. This right here. What? What? Automatically what? This claims me from anything. This what? This claims me from anything. No, you have that, that white, do. and I'm white. You have white privilege, right? Oh shit! Get the it, fuck it, out of here! This man is—he's lost. Give me what I had you hold. Every day. This is what the problem is. Because all take you that shit back to 8 Mile. Yeah, 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 take that shit back to 8 Mile, B Rabbit. We don't want to hear it. <laughs> yeah, your knees weak, your arms is heavy, just vomit on your back. <laughs> yeah, man. We're not hearing that. B Rabbit? Yeah. Take that hunk shit back to 8 Mile. Read. That's a lot. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 14 and verse 21. Prepare slaughter. Do what? Prepare slaughter. What? Prepare slaughter. What? Prepare slaughter. For his children. For what? For, For his, his children. children. No, that man didn't do anything. For his For children. children. Uh -huh. For the iniquity of their fathers. For the iniquity of your stinking ass fathers, man. Right. You got to pay. We had to pay. We had to pay. How the hell come we had to pay for these things, but they don't? They're not sorry. What did he say? I, I'm, I'm showing I'm remorseful by raising my kids up. To do what? To hang another nigga? That's what they raising their kids up to hey, do, man. What, what, what it sounds like is he laid down with the Eve and you got yeah, some. He, 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 he did. did. He did. He did. He did. I, I, I'm trying to my children. For I, your children? I, hey, I, they're Edomites too. I was trying to say, hold Damn on. Damn chocolate you covered Edomite, man. He might go home and uh. Go, and, and he need to go home and hang them little babies he got. Now he can do that to a husband. Yeah. Well, now I want them to hang the babies. Yeah, ain't, ain't talking that's about Eve. I want them to hang them damn babies, man. Keep bringing that up. He said, prepare slaughter for his children, for the iniquity of their fathers, uh -huh. that they do not rise. That they what? That, that they, they do, do not rise. rise. Uh -huh. Nor possess the land, nor fill the face of the world with cities. Hey, they're not going to fill the face of the world with cities anymore. That's what they do now. Everywhere they go is they damn thumbprint on everything, man. Everywhere. Even in these other countries, man, that that they have no business being in, right? They building embassies up over there, right? They got bases over uh, uh, in Iran. Wonder why they getting attacked? Hey, cause you're imposing on land that's not yours, man. Right? What's going on, brother? You got two minutes. Shalom, shalom. How you doing? You got two minutes. Stop and talk to him. All the time, bro. 
Yeah. All praise to the most high. All praise, all praise. So you know you're Israelite then, bro. Yeah, I've been knowing Israelites since birth. Okay, okay, yeah. all praise to the most high. So, brother, you knowing you're an Israelite, what we got to be doing in these last days? You don't want me 10 and 12. Good question. What we got to be doing? Because we know we're Israelite. Give me James 1 and 22. I'm asking you, brother. Yeah. What we got to be doing in these last days? We know we're Israelites. What we got to do? I just try to bear all the law, statutes, and commandments that were given to me by the Most High. Okay. What's, what's some law, statutes, and commandments? Uh, and just try not to uh, break them, for real. So, I mean, I go with the... Uh, laws go uh, Leviticus 11, and we get laws all through the Bible. So, uh, I mean, I try to... Uh, tell people about the Deuteronomy 28. Uh, Step up to the side talk, man. Can, can I get another reader? Step up to the side talk. We get laws all throughout the script, man. Like, uh, I mean, even with Jesus, he said he ain't come to take from the law. So, right. Jada, Tito, he came to, uh, so let, let's let's read a few laws, right? Give me Leviticus chapter uh, uh, 19, verse 27. 19. 28, actually. You give me uh, Numbers 15, 38. Cause how many how many laws do we have? Do you know? It's, Is it just the ten? Nah, the laws okay. go back all the way when uh Genesis. In Genesis. Yeah. So, yeah. so we got six hundred and thirteen laws, statutes, and commandments. We gonna go over a few today. I mean, they even talk about the Christian when he was fighting yeah. the angels. Yeah. So, I mean, that was a law that we got in uh in Genesis. Right. So let's read it. It's the book of Leviticus, chapter nineteen and verse twenty eight. Ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh. Like so like verse twenty seven. Leviticus 19, 27. Ye shall not round the corners of your heads, neither shalt thou mar the corners of thy beard. What, you know what that's going into? Yeah, I know. Uh, I've saved my beard. faith, but I got, got a line. Come on, brother. You can get a line up. It says shaving into your, your beard, you know what I mean? You can't do that. Because why? Can you give me that definition in the Zondervan Compact Bible Dictionary? Why? You know, so so we know. Did, did you know that? I, I knew that from birth, bro. Why'd you do it then, brother? Uh, spotty bird, man. Spotty I, bird. I went against my law. Brothers got spotty bird. <laughs> Brothers got spotty birds. Uh, bro, I've been, I been getting the roof from my old dude, man. Yeah, uh, you know what I mean? So, hey, because cause we're going to read what, what a beard is in the Bible. Let me sit back off. Yeah. We're going to read what, what, what a beard is to our people because because to, 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 you, to their people. I'd be scared to go around my old dude. Hey, brother, you should be. You're going to get that sharp review. Hey, but it's love. Nah, you know what I mean? Yeah, but your, your father loved you by telling you though, because if he didn't care about you, he wouldn't tell you. He'd let you do whatever you wanted to do. Hey, that's why we're in this position right now, because the most I love him. Hey, right. You know? Hey, we were just bringing that out earlier in Lamentations 3 and 22, because the Lord's mercies, hey, they're, they're great and they renew every day, right? But just because his mercies, right, and his grace, you know, uh, renews every day, they don't give us a license to keep sinning. Uh, nah. and, and, and that you knowing these things, it, it definitely doesn't get, because and you got a harsher judgment knowing these things, yeah. right? Bring this up. This, uh, this is the Zondervan Compact Bible Dictionary, uh -huh. and the word beard, a badge of manly dignity. Like what? A, a badge, badge of, of manly, manly dignity. dignity. So what happens when you take that manly dignity away? Yeah, that's femininity. Hey, now you're not a man no more, <laughs> right? You don't, you don't, you don't, hey, you, you can't hold your chin up. Like you say, you can't go around your pops. You can't hold your chin up high and go around your pops. It kind of hurt a little bit, man. That's the first thing you're going to say. Yeah. Hey, hold on. Hey, who's this? You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, it's not my son, man. Where are you bearing at? <laughs> hey, I recognize you coming through the door. Hey, then he got to pull out the precepts. Like a lion without his mane. Yeah, like a lion without his wizzy. It's he a gonna, lioness. He's chest down. Yeah. Hey, but but Lord willing, we, we can get get it to you first. You go to Pops. Hey, they, they got on me already, Pops. I know I got to do better, Pops. Right. Because if you don't, can you pick that sign up for me, Dave? You pick that sign up for me, Dave. Yeah. Cause if we don't, brother, we gonna keep going through this. Yeah, I mean, we ain't in chattel slavery right now, but we still in the middle of slavery. But brother, if we keep breaking the law, statutes, and commandments, slavery is gonna happen still. Like you say, it's it's a mental slavery. It's a physical slavery too. Nah, don't get it wrong. Yeah. We go to a nine to five every day. Yeah. You, mean, you get that? We just, we just had a mental aspect right there with them yeah. approaching yeah. us. Yeah, you know what I mean? This, yeah, you need to put on your neck, right? <laughs> it, it's still lynchings that happen to this day. Nah, man, it's just a few just happened. They right. Buried in Mississippi. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, so okay. we're, we're we're still going through that. It, it just it's just formed a little different. You know what I mean? 
we're not yeah we're not gonna go back on boats again we already did that we already fulfilled that part of the prophecy but we're gonna keep getting trotted down so with, with you breaking the commandments though brother there, there's a chance that that could happen again and another life could get lost hey because the lord doesn't always punish you he can punish the loved one that you have right and we're gonna keep going through this right are, are, are men going to these damn fraternities are uh, women following after these other nations are men doing this That's unseemly awesome. abominations right are women being whores hey picking up that swine you touch the swine bro I ain't never touched that. No, all praises. All praises. Huh? Hey, all praises, King. Yeah. That's good. You keep that, right? But now you gotta start keeping this, right? Give me James one twenty two, cause you knew that. You give me that uh, number. I ain't 15, never had swine in my life or seafood. Or seafood. Hey, that's 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 a blessing, brother. That's a blessing, brother. That you was raised in this thing, right? But now, like I said, now that you knowing that, the judgment is gonna be ten times harder for knowing that and forsaking it, right? Read. It's the book of James, chapter 1 and verse 22. Be ye doers of the word, uh -huh. and not hearers only. And not hearers only. Because you, you know. It. It's like it. De deceiving your own selves. Deceiving your own selves. Because you know, brother. Because you know, brother. Yeah, man. Yeah, don't don't be a hypocrite, brother. Uh, that's what right? I'm about the side seeds of Pharisees. Yeah. Hey, right. yeah, you, you, can't, you can't be like them, man. Right? And, and, and you, you got the knowledge, brother. Now it's just about implementing it, right? right? We all get it. We go off. You know, we yeah. fall short, brother, right. right? But you can't willingly go off because you knew that was a sin. Yeah. And you you, you had you premeditated that. You sat down, right? Got in the chair, right? They, 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 they put the bib on you. You know what I mean? Right? They looked at you before they got you. You sure? What's up, brother? Yeah, I'm sure. And they, they cut it down, man. They cut it down, brother. And you know that, right? So, but now knowing these things, brother, we just, we got to, we got to do better. You know better, we got to do better. Bring this up. We're going to give you another commandment. The book of Numbers, chapter 15 and verse 38. Speak unto the children of Israel uh -huh. and bid them that they make them fringes. That they make them what? That they make them fringes. What's fringes, brother? Fringes and borders. You got some? Nah, I ain't got my fringes. Ain't got none? What's, what's going on tonight? What's going on tonight, Let's brother? Let's some of my buddies out, man. Give me Exodus chapter 20, verse 8, too. Keep that. Give me Exodus chapter 20, verse 8. But it's, it's 8. It's how the Lord say 8. Hey, it's nothing but uh, wickedness in the midst of darkness. Right. You know what I mean? Hey, we don't come outside at dark time, man. Right. Especially not in St. Louis. There's nothing going on, right? It's nothing but wickedness, right? But we, yeah, we got to wear the fringes. Now, what are we wearing the fringes for? Do you know? I mean, I, I remember, man, but I, I can't. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll elaborate on it. Because, brother, if you had them fringes on, you probably wouldn't have cut your beard. Did you have your fringes on when you got the beard cut? See? See? Because if you had your fringes on when you was getting your beard cut, you would have looked down and did with this up. Hey, the barber probably looked like, hold on, buddy. Hold on. You know you can't do that. Hey, the, the, the Lord would have put a spirit on your barber. <laughs> hey, Dad packed up on you. And now you wonder. Are you like, worshiping? What are y'all talking about? We're talking about the Bible. The Bible? You believe in the Bible? Black Israelites? What is black, black Israelites? Black Israelites? What is that? Where do you see black at? I'm offended. Where do you know. see black at? It's the headgear. I heard Where the black, you see black at? this headgear. Where do you see black at? I'm offended. Nowhere. Who's black? Uh, what color is black? Is anybody black. this color? Yeah, that's, see, something. that's black. Oh, see is black. any person black up here? Dumb dumb. Listen. This color. That black? Yeah. <laughs> People, I guess brown, I guess. Brown, right? right? Okay. Give me, give me Revelation 13 and verse 9. Yeah. That's that's disrespecting us, man. You lucky we won't put hands and feet on you for that. And that's run nice, you up man. the damn block. Have fun worship, Read man. this. No, no, no. Read the judgment real quick, you damn heathen. It's the book of Revelation, chapter 13. You know the truth. Verse nine. Nine. It's the yeah. book of Revelation, chapter 13, and verse number 9. It's like, damn. And it reads. If any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth in the captivity shall go into captivity. What the Lord said? He that leadeth in the captivity shall go into captivity. And he that killeth with a sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the patience and the faith of the saints. Hey, 
playing upon the table. Damn heathens, like, man. Here, here we are calling ourselves the Israelites. God shows the people. Where do you see black? Hold on. And they still got a Where do you see black at right they here, brother? They still put a by word to it. That's why I Is look. there black anywhere on her? That's why I Do you see B-H-I? He knew who we were. That's crazy. He knew who the hell we were, man. Hey, damn Satan, man. Satan. Yeah, he's lucky. He's lucky we didn't tear his ass up, man. I can't wait for the day when, when we get back to where Nehemiah hey, was just putting hey, his feet on those, he, he ran those, uh, you know? those, those the, the, Yeah, he knows who we are. Hey, uh, he said we fit the description. He said, oh, the, the head wraps. The head wraps. Yeah. He fits the description. Get him. You see what I'm saying? Hold on. Hey. Brother, you ain't fitting the description right now. He didn't know you was Israelite. Oh, no, brother. Really? He didn't know you was Israelite. Yeah. You would have got out scot free. Bro, we over here getting beat down by Esau, man. Hey, brother, you got to fit the description with us. Hey, because these are identifying markers to know that you're Israelite. Right. And, and, and really, chiefly, you know, going, going back to the fringes thing, hey, in that last days, you know, you're not wearing them now. When we start getting persecuted, right? I know he is Israelite. I seen him with them fringes on they gonna start persecuting people with fringes on and with Bibles. Are you gonna tuck your fringes in and that day? You gonna take them off and cast them away and throw the Bible away? It ain't me. You gonna deny them? Cause brother, you denying them right now. Shoot. Right? And 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 and, 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 and we don't we don't want to really beat you down too much, brother. We really want to lift you up and exhort you to start doing these things. Right? Cause this brothers out here, hey. When we was alone in the world, it was hard to keep these things. We had worldly friends going out on the Shabbat. Right? Bring this up. The book of Numbers, chapter 15 and verse 38. Speak unto the children of Israel uh -huh. and bid them. And do what? And, and bid, bid them uh -huh. that they make them fringes in the borders of their garments uh -huh. throughout their generations. Throughout their generations. And that, that they, and that they put upon the fringe of the borders a ribbon of blue. Uh -huh. And it shall be unto you for a fringe right. that ye may look upon it. That ye may what? That ye may look upon it. That ye may what? And that ye may look upon it. God, look upon it, brother, and what? And remember all the commandments of the Lord. Uh -huh. You're going to remember all the commandments of the Lord when you look upon it. Right. Next time you thought on, next time you think, right, about going off, next time you think maybe about cutting that beard down, next time you think about going out on the Shabbat, you got to slide that shirt with fringes over your head. Yes, like, sir. oh, that's off. I can't do that. You know what I mean? I can't do them things. Yeah, you can't do those things. Right? Why? Uh, to, to remember them into what? Because you can't just be a hero of the word. Remember that. You got to be a what? Said that ye, it's like it, and do them. And what? And, and do, do them. them. I just hear them. And, and do, do them. them. You gotta do them too, brother. Right. The Bible tells us time and time and time again. Can't just be hearers of the word. We gotta be doers as well, brother. Yes, sir. Right. So we're gonna lift the brother up a little bit. Give me uh, uh Joshua chapter one and verse nine, right? Give me uh second back of each chapter ten and verse thirty-three. Yeah, actually hold that. Hold it. Just bring this up. Give me the Joshua one and nine. The book of Joshua, chapter one and verse number nine. Verse eight. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth, uh -huh. but thou shalt meditate therein day and night. How long? Day, day and, and night. night. Not whenever you feel like it. Day, day and, and night. night. Uh -huh. That thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. Uh -huh. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous. So then this is going to make our way prosperous, right? And then thou shalt have good success. Have what? Have, have good, good success. success. Have not I commanded thee? Be strong. So the Lord commanded us to be what? To be, be strong, strong. Uh -huh. and, and of a good courage. And of what? And, and of a good, good courage. courage. Uh -huh. Be not afraid, uh -huh. neither be thou dismayed. For the Lord thy God is with thee. For the what? For, For the Lord, Lord thy God is with thee. One more time. For, For the Lord, Lord thy God, God is with thee. The Lord is with you, brother. Right? Don't cast the Lord behind your back because he didn't cast uh, you behind his back. Right? Keep going. Whithsoever thou goest. Wherever you go, the Lord is going to be with you, right? But hey, if you turn your back on the Most High, He's going to give you over to this world, right? I'm going to bring out this other commandment because what's today, brother? The Shabbat. Where was you at just a minute ago? The House of Soul? House of Soul. You got something to drink down there? I don't drink. Yeah, no drinks. What you, what you down? You got something to eat? Uh, nah, I was waiting for my own boy, but he ain't show up. Hey, yeah. well, we glad. Well, you, you got you got brothers right here. See that? Your brothers did show up. God. <laughs> hey, give me Proverbs chapter 24 and verse 20. Or 20 and verse 24. Right, give me Jeremiah 10, 23. Because he know, he know about it. Yeah, he know about the Sabbath. What, what day is the uh, the Sabbath? Today, right? Is it, is it, is it, is it 12 at night on Saturday? Is that when it kick in? Sundown. Sundown, brother. Hey, all praises to the most high. <laughs> 
Hey, we glad to meet another brother out here, man. Hey, you know what I mean? Bring this up. It's a book. It's the book of Proverbs at the 20 and verse 24. Man's goings are of the Lord. What the Lord say? Man's, Man's goings are of the Lord. Lord. How can a man then understand his own way? How can a man understand? Hey, the, the Lord had your homeboy now show up. He had you come on down here and hey, meet the man of the Lord today, man. Right? And hey, you a man of the Lord too, brother. God. Right? You just got to convert those ways back to following the Lord. Right? And truly and, and sincerely serving him. Right? You got something? It's the book of Jeremiah chapter 10 and verse 23. Oh, Lord, I know that the way of man is not in himself. Uh -huh. It is not in man that walketh to direct his steps. You don't, you don't know where you're going. Right? The Lord directs everywhere that we go. Right? So the Lord brought you down here today, and that's a beautiful thing. Right? Hey, we get you some exhortation on keeping these things. Now, do you got fringes at home? Yeah. You got fringes? You got you got the wardrobe fringe? You got the whole closet I, I, full? I, I, I wear it doing Passover. Okay. Okay. Now, is it is it is it just for a season that we we supposed to wear them? Nah, we supposed to wear them every day, right? Okay. Now, can I ask you what's the reason for not wearing them? Like, is it is it something that is prohibiting you from wearing the fringes, or you just don't want to? I ain't gonna uh, prohibit me. Huh? Cause... What would you say it is? Then? Like, why why would you know you know them? I mean, anything I say would be making an excuse. Right. Uh, it's just no better. Right. But just just you know just for. For edification, like why? What would I, just cause? Nah, I go to therapy in the gym. Okay. 24 7, so that's pretty much the, uh, my okay. daily routine. So. Okay. I mean, I can't wear it to the gym. Yeah, you can't wear it. Like you say, it, it really it ain't this be because because give me a little Matthew chapter five verse sixteen. Because by you wearing them fringes, brother, hey, that could that could I. I'm gonna let the scriptures be written. It's the book of Matthew chapter five and verse sixteen. And it reads, let your light so shine before men, let your light so shine before men, that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. And that they may glorify your Father which is in heaven. That's the, that's the whole purpose of it. Somebody see that, they see you being that light. Damn, I seen them on some brothers out on Washington before. They come up and approach you, they ask. Now you breaking the scripture down to them. And Lord willing, you might get a sheep, you might plant that seed, and the Lord, they raise them up. And now they become an Israelite. Now they end in this truth. Now right. they keeping a Passover, right. keeping a feast of dedication, all right? Uh, a feast of tabernacles, and all the high holy days that the Lord has commanded us to keep. Yeah, the new moons. We got new moon on uh, 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 Monday, Sunday. Sunday night. Right. You know what I mean, right? So Don't hey, need yeah, turn the clip. There's a lot of things happening out here. This, this, this is the 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 worst time to not be keeping the laws. Man. You know what I mean? Because if you've been keeping them your whole life, right? And you getting in, you now you just kind of slowly turn away. Give me that uh, in a race too. You know what I'm talking about, Matthew? Oh yeah, gotcha. Because you know now, now it, it, you you at the end of the race. You don't want to stop and just just turn around and start going the other way. <laughs> you at the finish line right there, brother. And you just you just stop, you stop all form of progress and turn around and, and, and go back to the ways of the world, right? That you never even knew because you knew this from a baby, right? This is the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 9 and verse 24. Know ye not that they which run in a race run all, uh -huh. but one receiveth the prize. Uh -huh. So run that ye may obtain. That ye may. Yeah. Said so run that ye may obtain. And every man that striving for the mastery is temperate in all things. Hey, so now, run that you may obtain these things. So you got to run that you may obtain these things because it's only, it's, it's one winner at the end of the day. Right. right? It's going to be a small portion of the elect that's, that's going to be right. saved. And they're going to be scarcely saved. Right? Right. It says, yeah. now they do it to obtain a corruptible crown, uh -huh. but we incorruptible. But what? But, but we, we incorruptible. incorruptible. We're trying to obtain an incorruptible crown. Right. Right, Reed? I therefore so run. Not as uncertainly, uh -huh. so fight I, not as one that beat at the air. Hey, but some people don't know what they're doing. They don't know what they're doing it for. You know what I mean? You know what you're doing it for. Read. It says, but I keep under my body and bring it into subjection. Uh -huh. Lest by any means, when I have preached to others, I myself should be a castaway. That when you what? That, that I might preach to others, uh -huh. I myself should be a castaway. Right, yeah, you gotta preach to others and bring these things back into the fold. All right. right. What you have another? This is the book of Second Edris, chapter 15 and verse number 24. Woe to them that sin and keep not my commandments, saith the Lord. What, what do you say? Woe to, Woe them, to them that, that sin, sin and, and keep, keep not, not my commandments, commandments, saith the Lord. Uh -huh. I will not spare them. 
I will, go, what? I will I not spare them. them. I will not what? I will, I will not, not spare them. them. Read. Go your way, ye children, from the power. Defile not my sanctuary. Do what? Defile, Defile not, not my, my sanctuary. sanctuary. Because you know about the time during during Maccabees, right? It was defiling the temple, right? Putting the pork in there on the altar. Hey, now this this the this, this the spiritual temple. You know what I mean? It's a spiritual altar that we give the sacrifices to. Right? We out here presenting our body as a living sacrifice. Cold out here. Hey, brothers may have just got off work. Hey, but we out here because we love our people. And we love right. our people that truly love and seek understanding. Right? Bring us up. Right? Because this this was this was promised 12 and 8. This was promised to us, brother. It's the book of Zechariah. Right. If we endure into the end, if we become the hopeful elect, this is what's promised to us. Give me first Samuel chapter 18. This is the book of Zechariah, chapter 12 and verse number 8. Uh -huh. In that day shall the Lord defend the inhabitants of Jerusalem. Hey, the Lord's going to defend us in that day. Read. And he that is feeble among them uh -huh. at that day shall be as David. Shall be as David. And you know how mighty David was, brother. Yeah, let's say David had a heart of God. And they had, David had a heart after the Lord, man. That's why That's why David, you know, the Lord didn't charge David with the, the, uh, the sin that he had committed, right? And he said, I'll cast that out, right? You, you, you repented. Hey, you, you, you cried, you fasted, and hey, you was truly sorrowful for the things that you did, and the Lord cast them things out. 18 and 7. Uh, read on it, yeah. Said, and the house of David shall be as God. Shall be as what? Shall, shall be, be as God. God. Uh -huh. As the angel of the Lord before them. As the angel of the Lord, but that's a mighty thing. That, that, so the littlest, the smallest, it's going to be as David, man. So that's a powerful thing we all look forward to. That's what is strengthening you in those times of weakness. Right? When you feeling low, right? And you feeling like, man, I've been in this thing, ain't nothing kicked off yet. It's how do you brother if your mommy has I'm 40. 40? You look good, man. Hey, hey, I thought you thought you was in your twenties, bro. <laughs> I just just turned 40. I see that? that? Right? All praise to the most high that you got to live to this age. But you know, with the thing with that being said, brother, hey, just because, you know, hey, it's some people that fall out because they like, man, I've been in this thing, you know, hey, you forty years, man, since birth. Ain't nothing happened yet. Is there anything ever gonna happen? You don't want your give me a uh, uh, it's like a proverbs at twenty four verse ten. What, uh, give me bring that. Uh, well, yeah, get that proverbs and you keep that uh, first hand. Proverbs twenty four verse ten. Uh -huh. The proverbs of the twenty four verse ten. If thou faint in the day of adversity, uh -huh. thy strength is small. That what? Thy, thy strength, strength is small. Is small. Hey, the Lord, like, like your faith is small, man. If you faint in that day of adversity, right? Because you wax and weary and weary through the faith, you know what I mean? Right? Hey, it could be maybe you're not congregating amongst us brothers. You know what I mean? You're hanging around too many worldly people. And that, that, that'd that be, they, they smothering the fire that you got. You know what I mean? Like, plus they putting it under a bushel, right? You want to let that light shine. That's wearing the fringes and wearing the beard. You know, being that example, hey, to, to your worldly friends, that they may come into the truth. Right, we've all had brothers that we we told the truth to, and they, they brought them into this thing. Hey, you got a lot of years. You probably told, but they damn, I, you know what I mean? Hey, now you, you that, that's used to a run beautiful from me feeling. When I was a kid. Yeah, hey, hey, I, I, I'm, I'm we all know it. We all tell our family. Terry come with that Bible, man. Hey, we know, brother. We've been there with you, right? Hey, but you know, it, when you when you get around brothers that's sincere, and you start seeing them do the work, right? You see that when you wake somebody up, that, that feeling and that joy that you get from seeing a sinner repent, right? And know that they're an Israelite and not just some Negro out here. That's a beautiful thing. Right. Hey, it, it down there bring you to tears, man. And on the con on, on the other half, right, it bring us to tears when brothers like that, you know, walking around asking for money to get high. Hey, that'll bring us to tears too, man. Because our people are desolate and destroyed out here. Hey, and, 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 yeah, man. Hey, it, it, it hurts us, man. Truthfully, it hurts us to see those things, man. To see our people so low when, when they said the little is going to be like David. Right. Where was our mighty men at? Where did they go? Where was our forefathers that's run to, to, to die for the, for the uh, law, statutes, and commandments of the right. most high? Right? And hey, they didn't give a damn. Bring it out for Samuel. 18 and 18 7. It's the book of 1 Samuel, chapter 18 and verse 7. And the women answered one another as they played and said, uh -huh. so. Saul has slain his thousands. Saul has slain his thousands. And David his ten thousands. And what? And, and David, David is ten thousands. Come on. Like I said, can you imagine how many that is? And, and that's just to represent David. The, the little so you're going ten times above David. You know what I mean? Hey, the feeble is gonna be like David, right? 
Hey, so the, so the men that was really out there putting in the work, really laboring, hey, how much more are they gonna be? Be as God, right? And not the most high God, of course. Nah, yeah. You know what I mean? But you know, hey, so that's what we're looking forward to by keeping these commandments, right. by enduring into the end. Right, right, what are you hoping? It's the book of Joshua chapter 23 and verse 10. One man of you shall chase a thousand. For the Lord your God, he it is that fighteth for you uh -huh. as he hath promised you. Hey, the Lord is gonna fight for us. The Lord's gonna fight for us in those end days. The Lord will fight for us now and war these spirits that we may have on us all. Well, you know what I mean? Take good heed therefore unto yourselves uh -huh. that ye love the Lord your God. That what? That ye, ye love, love the Lord, Lord your God. God. How you show God you love him, brother? Obeying his laws, obeying his laws, man. Yeah, brother got the whole breakdown. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, brother know A to Z, man. Right? We just got to get you back in this thing. Give me Zephaniah chapter two and verse one. Give me Genesis chapter forty nine and verse one. You in there? Tell them you can't come, brother. It's a Sabbath, it's a Sabbath brother. brother. It's a day of rest. It's a day that you get to the Lord. Right? Give me, uh, actually, go, give me Exodus. Just go give home me, with him. Yeah, give me Exodus. Dave, uh, 20 he ain't birthday. showed up for you. You might as well right. just go ahead home. Like, yeah, I left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm already gone, <laughs> I'm already gone, home, bro. Genesis 49, and verse number one. And Jacob called unto his unto his sons and said, Gather yourselves together. What the Lord say? Gather, Gather yourselves together. together. That's like, what did Jacob say? Gather, Gather yourselves, yourselves together. together. Uh -huh. That I may tell you that which shall befall you in the last days. So we gotta start gathering ourselves together right. with like-minded men. Yes, you, don't, you don't wanna be around worldly brothers because he going in there, he going in there and do what? Probably drink. Probably drink. Hey, you don't wanna be among sinners, man. You wanna separate yourself. Can you give me that in the book of... Uh, I got precept for that. Good. It's the book of Proverbs chapter 13 and verse 20. He that walketh with the wise, it's like he that walketh with wise men shall be wise. But a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Shall be destroyed. You can't have a companion of fools. Give me uh, Amos chapter 3 and verse 3. Right? Give me uh, uh, Okay, bring it up. It's the book of Amos chapter 3 and verse 3. Can two walk together except they be agreed? What the Lord Can, Can two, two walk together, together except, except they, they be agreed? agreed? Uh -huh. so can two walk together except they be agreed? Y'all not equally yoked, brother. You know what I mean? You, you trying to all the laws that you command us. You want to go get drunk on the Shabbat. You don't even drink. So what, 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 what purpose is going down there to the house of soul where it's nothing but women in tight clothes. Soulless people. Right, soulless people, right? The damn dry <laughs> bones down there. The house of soul. Yeah, the house of soul. Hey, you're getting your soul took in there, man. Soul stolen. Yeah. Hey, as soon as you walk in there, you just deplete. Ugh. Yeah, you just, yeah, you just start. <laughs> Now you don't even know what's going on. Right. Now you in the midst of wickedness. Hey, it's now like it's like the uh, going on. like the crossroads video when dude walked in there and touched people before his their eyes just turned black. Yeah, man. I don't know if you seen uh that, that wicked movie of uh, the lightning thief and they was eating those uh little things and they was in there for like three years. Some people was in there from the 70s because they got so caught up on all the the pleasure of this world and they didn't realize what was going on. They woke up and it's, it's, it's 2013. How it come from 1970 to 2013? Because the lust of this world is seduction, right? Remember the good old days? Yeah, if you got ears to hear, man, it, 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 the, the, the love of this world, it, it, it do some, some crazy things. That's the book of Sirach, chapter 13 and verse number 17. Bring it up. What fellowship hath the wolf with the lamb? What fellowship hath the wolf with the lamb? So the sinner with the God. So the mm. sinner with the God, right? You don't you don't want to hang around the monks of uh, sinners, man. Right. Hey, cause they they start persuading you to do these things. Because hey, I, I know how I was. I was I was real lukewarm before I came into a body. Cause I used to be around a lot of worldly people. I used to I used to I used to wait for the sun to go down on the, on the Sabbath. I'm I'm timing, <laughs> and I'm going out to the club as soon as the sun go down break. You know what I mean? Hey, that's wicked, right? Hey, I, I wasn't going that hard for the Lord. I was trying to find all ways and manners to be wicked Setting up with wick the keeping spot. the law. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, deceitful. Yeah, yeah. And, and we can't be lukewarm because in uh, uh, Revelation 13 and 15, the Lord will spew us out of his mouth. Sure. It's the last thing we want. Yes, it's for sir. the Lord to do away with us. For you to wake up tomorrow and be, you, you don't remember the name of your whole Bashem Yahweh Shah. Hey, hey, that, that's, that, that hurt, man. I say, if I 
get the name of the Lord. Hey, you gotta take me out this thing, man. <laughs> I don't want to live because it's nothing to go back to. Right. It's nothing in this world to go back to. Right. Especially oh. since you don't already do those things. Right. You know what I mean? So there, there is nothing you have in common with a son. Now it's nothing wrong, you know, with talking to the brother, yeah, trying to so. give him the truth. Hey, but we don't hang out with our world. You know what I mean? And we don't want to get seduced to do that with you. It's the book, sorry, rap to the six and verse 13. Separate thyself from thy enemies. Yeah. Separate, Separate thyself, thyself from thy enemy. Separate, Separate thyself, thyself from thy enemy. And take heed of thy friends. Right here on 13 and boy. No, I'm on 13 and boy. I'm gonna come yeah, down here and get this word, man. It's the book of Exodus, chapter 20 and verse 8. Remember the Sabbath day. What the Lord say? Remember, Remember the, the Sabbath, Sabbath day. day. What the Lord say? Remember, Remember the, the Sabbath, Sabbath day. day. And what? To keep it holy. To what? To, to keep, keep it holy. holy. To what? To, to keep, keep it holy. holy. Six days shall thy labor and do all thy work. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the Sabbath day. Don't know about Sabbath. Yeah, that's cool. Don't know about Sabbath day too. Get out. Yeah, I mean, you sir. No, you won't. Nah, they say this dead. They ain't messing with it. All, all praises. Hey, hey, yeah. What? Hey, the house is sold? Yeah. Hey, well, good, all brother. All You're praises. not messing with it either, brother. Read it. Say, remember the Sabbath day. It's like in Exodus chapter 20 and verse uh, 8. Remember the Sabbath day uh -huh. to keep it holy. To do what? To, to keep, keep it holy. What's holy mean, brother? Set apart. You gotta keep this day set apart. Yes, sir. Read on. You got six days. Six days shall thou labor shall do and what? do all. It's like it. Six days shall thou labor uh -huh. and do, do all thy work. work. Uh -huh. But the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. The Sabbath of the Lord. Keep reading. In it thou shalt not do any work. Uh -huh. Thou nor thy son nor thy daughter, thy manservant nor thy maidservant, uh -huh. nor thy cattle, nor thy stranger that is within thy gates. Uh -huh. For in six days the Lord made heaven and earth, the sea. And all that in them is and rested the seventh day. Who, well, who, who rested on that seventh day right there? Oh, the Lord. The yeah. Lord. So if the Lord rested, shouldn't you rest? Yeah. We're well, not, we not better than the Lord, are we? No way. No way. So you got to tell that. And you're not coming out tonight. <laughs> you can't come out tonight, brother. Hey, because the Lord commanded us. Hey, he gave this day for us to, for a rest day. And, and above all, to serve him on this day. Right. Pray. Read. You know, study, hop into these things, build ourselves up through the spirit. I don't know if you got a family, build your family up through the spirit. You know what I mean? It's been a uh, battle. Man. You know, and, and, and it's, it, we got to endure. It's always going to be a battle, especially around this season. Right. Brothers been catching hell around this Passover season. Right. Sir, brothers sir. have been catching hell. And it's slow the spirit been kicking on, brothers. Brothers been getting weeded out the truth, going back to their vomit like the dog. Hey, we, we know. We, we not exempt from it. We catch hell. Like I say in uh, Proverbs uh, 24 and 16, a just man falls seven times, but he gets back up. You gotta get back up, brother. You had that? Uh, well, for the Lord blessed the Sabbath day and hallowed it. And hallowed it, man. He made it holy. It's the book of Isaiah, to the 58 and verse 13. Uh -huh. If thou turn away thy foot, so if thou turn away thy foot from the Sabbath, from doing thy pleasure, on my holy day and called the Sabbath a delight. The Lord, so like the holy, so like the holy of the Lord, honorable and shall honor him, not doing thy own ways, nor finding thy own pleasure, nor speaking thy own words. So if you turn away from your own pleasures on this Lord, uh, on this day of the Lord, you know what I mean? That's what we gotta be doing. Don't don't give in to the lust of your flesh doing your own things that you want to do, right? Because like we said, it's a punishment that comes that and you above all you know, brother. Brother, you no. Know, right? Come here, brother. Give me uh give me some rack chapter 18 and verse 30. See that? See that? Give me some rack at 18 and verse 30. Give me proper right. 18 and 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. Yeah. Some rack 18. Always just keep talking. Uh, pro about proper 25 to me. Right? Hey, could you? The book of Proverbs chapter 25 and verse 28. Uh -huh. He that have no rule over his own spirit is like a city that is broken, broken down, down and without, and without walls. walls. And without walls, but you don't want to be that city that's broken down where they just 
They coming in there, they stepping on everything. You know what I mean? Muddying up the the, the, the all white rug you got. Man. They stomped in the mud and they coming in there and now they walking all in on, on, on the white carpet. Like, hey, no, those, yeah, I was about to say those Saints come in like uh like uh Rick James on Dave Spence. Yeah, man, kick it nice place, over, man. Yeah. <laughs> nice place. <laughs> Knocking stuff over, man. Hey, you, know, you want to have that, that spirit right built up around you, yes. right? Bring it up. It's the book of Messiah Rap, chapter 18 and verse 30. Uh -huh. Go not after thy lust. Do what? Go, Go not, not after, after thy, thy lust, lust. Uh -huh. but refrain from, thy from, thy own, from thine appetite. So refrain from your appetite. Refrain, refrain from the things that your flesh wants to do, right? right? Give me other uh, book of Galatians, Galatians uh, chapter 5, verse 16. Uh -huh. Verse 31. If thou givest thy soul, so if thou givest thy soul the desires that please her, she will make thee a laughing stock. She will what? She will, she will make, make thee, thee a laughing, laughing stock uh -huh. to thine enemies that malign thee. Hey, and, and really your enemies could be the, your worldly friend. They know you know the truth. I know you don't go out and say, I'm still gonna ask you. He gonna right. come out. Watch this, right. watch this. We gonna say if he gonna come out. Hey, 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 try to tempt you with things, man. I, I had my homie, he invited me to his birthday party and didn't tell me it was his birthday party. That shit was wicked. I, I almost, we almost uh, we almost had to go to the bathroom for a few minutes. Hey. You know what I mean? Cause that that's I, hey, I almost put my hands on him. Hey, you know I don't do that shit. Why would you do that to me? So you you know what? I, See that? Huh? You was there? Yeah. He invited me. Hey, brother, we got something going on at the crib. Slide on through. I bet. But the night is down there over with, and they pull out a birthday cake with damn candles on it, man. Just so waiting for you, waiting for you to come in the door. I said, what is this? Wait, exactly what you got there. No, not no. They waited for the whole night to be almost over with. Oh man. Oh, and then they oh. pulled it out, poured 21 shots for them. I said, I said, I, I said, bro, I know you ain't just do this. I know you ain't just do it. Hey, and that's why we that's why we gotta separate ourselves. Hey, until another point, right? I saw somebody post something, right? They said, man, they said, man, it's like you laced me. If you served me pork and didn't tell me I, that there was yeah. pork in that plate. Like you laced like, me it's like, you get, like, you, like you laced me, man. Yeah. But you put hey, they did the, they did the Rick Ross. <laughs> Drop something in your drink. Yeah. <laughs> Molly all in your champagne. Oh. They, they ain't know. They ain't know. They ain't know. The other part is work. We ain't going to say that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> they invite to the feet. Feet. Huh? The hands and feet. Oh, give me Nehemiah 13 uh, 21. Nehemiah 13 21. Yeah, hey, no doubt. Hey, because our forefathers are mighty, man. This is what they used to come and do. Look at Nehemiah, chapter 13, and verse number 21. Because Nehemiah didn't play, man. Ezra didn't play. Our forefathers was not with the BS, man. Hey, Nehemiah was thrusting Moab hey, and our people through. Let me catch our land down here. Yeah, 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 yeah. off with your head, man. He didn't play. Three. The book of Nehemiah chapter 13 and verse 21. Then I testified against them and said unto them, Why lie ye about the wall? Uh -huh. If ye do so again, I will lay hands on you. I will what? I will, I will lay, lay hands, hands on you. Nehemiah coming to whoop ass you. Let, let, come, come around this wall again on what? From that time forth, they came no more on the Sabbath. On what? On the, on the Sabbath. Sabbath. On what? On, on the, the Sabbath. Sabbath. Hey, come around on the Sabbath no more. Right. Sometimes you got to tell your homie, hey, come around me on the Sabbath. Hey, put these hands on you. Don't come around me on the Sabbath. Right. Don't tempt me. Don't text me. I'm going to put my phone on D&D. &D. I'm serving the Lord. I'm reading. I'm watching videos. The brother's going out on the street teaching, edifying, maybe taking notes. Hey, or you could be out here doing the same thing, brother. Right. Teaching your people, edifying your people. Getting right. your people built up through the spirit. Yes, you got sir. 40 years on this, brother. Been in thing ten months. You got a lot of not. You got a not, lot of knowledge and wisdom that you can pass down to our people yep. that we so desperately need. Especially, you know, yeah, especially the youth, right? A lot of these brothers are young up here, man. You know what I mean? We need some some, some elder people that that been in this thing. Some hey, righteous leaders. Yeah, some righteous leaders. Because we, we 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 may not be able to get to the brother, but you may got that. You know, what I'm saying that knowledge that hey, he listen right to you. You yeah. know, what I'm saying had to come at this angle. You know what I mean? I'm all with it, bro. Hey, cause me, I, I, I shake the hand a lot. You know what I mean? It's hard for me to refrain from shaking the hand. I hate some people. Some people they be coons and they give me out the spirit too quick. It's a, it's a lot. Know what I mean? This brother never tastes swine. You know what I'm saying? And if we would have had to beat the white boy ass, he would have told the police seven black Hebrew Israelites whooped me. 
and an African American sat there and watched. <laughs> no, come on, man. Come on, you don't want to just be that African American that watched. African American. Man. Man. The, 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 what did they say? The black guy. It was just the black guy. It was just the black guy. These other guys were black, he original. Like, they're different. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Right, so you don't, you don't want to just be, be the first. Negro, right? right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it can't be the host Negro, man. <laughs> hey, because at, at the end of the day, Jay Z say, still niggas. Right. Still niggas at the end of the day. How do you feel, nigga? Rich nigga, oh. Right. Hey, still niggas. Right. how you see, you still a nigga. Right. Hey, boo, that. John, chapter 15. John 15 and 3. Now you are clean. He said what? Now, now you, you are, are clean. clean. One more time. Now, now you, you are clean. clean. You know? Through the word. Through the what? Through, Through the, the word. Through the what? Through, Through the, the word. word. Which I have spoken unto you. Because we're reading the words of the Most High. That's right.